Charlotte and Robin, the Renegade Twins, who have competed in AEW. Possibly the hottest independent women's tag team right now in a title match against the Vanity Twins, Jada and Jordan. And the trash talking has already started as we see the Vanity Twins slapping their asses in the direction of the Renegade Twins. There's quite a height difference here. The Renegade Twins, I would say, are close to six feet tall. And it appears the Vanity Twins are quite a lot shorter. I'm not sure if it's a foot or not, but it looks like there's a big size difference here. Both of these teams are, of course, gorgeous. It will be interesting to see how this plays out. As I said, the Vanity Twins have also wrestled for AEW. They definitely got to be on the radar of both WWE and AEW. And the winner of this match, whoever becomes the first UWW champions, will definitely get the feather in their cap here. And, and I'm sure the major companies are going to pay attention to who, who wins this match and, and watch this match as well. As we see the one of the Renegade Twins here making fun of the size difference of the Vanity Twins, saying maybe she should get on her knees. If I was the Vanity Twin here, I would just attack. Oh, and, and she did. Slap right to the face. These, these Renegade Twins are dressed like they're ready for a street fight tonight. I, I love the look of the ripped jeans here. Big tackle. Showing the power difference. More trash talking. Hits the ropes. Drop down by the Vanity Twin. Ducks the clothesline. Comes off. Looks like she was going for a rock bottom, but now, now a headlock. Headlock takeover with the Renegade Twin pulling the hair, but Vanity Twin has it, has it tight. The Renegade Twin making her way up. Reverses it. Reverses it. We're seeing some technical wrestling here to start things off. Hits the ropes. Amazing. Now showing, now showing off and adding some insult to, to injury here. There's a lot of trash talking going on in this match. So we see an arm bar makes the tag. That hip toss looks like it took a lot out of the Renegade Twin. Double back elbow. Now it looks like it's going to be a double elbow. They only have a five count. One, two, not quite. Not quite a three. There's a lot on the line here. The titles that we saw at the start of this match look like they're worth a lot of money and would look very good on either of these teams. Vanity Twins have been in control of this match, though, so far. Now adding some more insult to injury and gets spanked for her efforts. Boot to the midsection now. Throws her into the ropes. Duck clothesline comes off the ropes. Bulldog headlock now to the Renegade Twin. The Vanity Twins are showing some superior technical ability so far. Even though both of these teams are relatively new to the wrestling business, is the one Renegade Twin just kicked the Vanity Twin in the back right in front of the referee. I don't think the referee is watching now, though. As we see a hair pull down to the mat. And some strikes now to the face, but they're, they're covered up. We're seeing some frustration. I think the size difference is going to be too much for the Vanity Twins in this match as we see a smash to the turnbuckle pad there. Big chop. Big chop. Say what you want about pro wrestling. That looked like it hurt. Now we see a tag and another chop. It looks like the Renegade Twins are really enjoying this. Could this be a double chop? 
painful. That this, this vanity twin is earning her money tonight. Getting beat on like that. But not enough to even get a two count. It looked like about a one and a half there. We're going to see a camel clutch. It looks like this might be a camel clutch. Reminiscent of the Iron Sheik. With some hair pulling and some eye raking. The referee is being very lenient on the rules, I have to say. He, he's not staying on the Renegade Twins for, for all of their rule breaking, which I don't even think they have to do in this match. I think they're just street fighters. And they really want to punish their opponents here. They just don't want to beat them. They want to hurt them. And we're seeing some good evidence of it now. Another turnbuckle and tag here by the Renegade Twins. We, looks like we're going to see a double suplex now. I'm very impressed with these Renegade Twins. Since the last match I saw of theirs, they seem to have improved greatly. I'd be surprised if WWE does not pick them up in 2023. Big slam. Going for a pinfall attempt here. Almost a three count. Barely kicked out. Now some more trash talking. Just grabbing the hair and dashing it. Saying, you want to kick out of two? I'm going to teach you a lesson. And again, the referee... It is not really punishing these girls for their rule breaking as we see a big kick to the sternum. Another turnbuckle. I like the use of the turnbuckles. We're looking at some backfiring right now by the Renegade Twins and now a double neckbreaker slash DDT something I'd never seen before there and here's the tag the fresh woman is in the ring now she's fired up big clothesline another clothesline another clothesline booty to the midsection hip to the midsection throws the renegade twins and it looks like we're going to see possibly an avalanche Cross body. I don't think it's going to be enough. No. One and a half. I don't think the... I think the size difference is just too much here. To overcome the Renegade Twins. As one of them is in the corner now. And we see a tag by the Vanity Twins. It's, looks like they're going to do some type of arm ringer type maneuver here. But the other Renegade Twin is grabbing the arms and smashes the two Vanity Twins together. Throws them against the ropes. Is this going to be choke slam? I, I don't know if I've ever even seen women do choke slams. But we got a double choke slam by the Renegade Twins. And it looks like it's coming to the end here for the Vanity Twins. Valiant effort. But, but this is going to be all she wrote. I don't see them getting up from this. First UWW Women's Champions, the Renegade Twins. Let's get the official word. Congratulations. Ultimate Women of Wrestling Tag Team Champions.